Unveiling Amicus Curiae, a legal Latin term explained. Hello, and welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're diving into a fascinating Latin phrase used in the legal world, Amicus Curiae. This term might sound complex, but we'll break it down together, ensuring you can understand and use it confidently. Let's explore what it means and how it's applied in legal contexts. Amicus Curiae translates to friend of the court in Latin. This term refers to someone who is not a party to a case and is not solicited by a party, but who assists a court by offering information, expertise, or insight that has a bearing on the issues in the case. The aim is to aid the court in reaching a decision, providing a broader perspective on the implications of its judgment. An amicus curiae may be brought into a case to advise on a matter of law or some other aspect of the case that is beyond the judge's specialized knowledge. They are most often seen in appellate courts, including the Supreme Court, where they submit amicus briefs. These documents provide arguments or relevant information to the court which the judges may consider in their ruling. Typically, an amicus curiae is a subject matter expert or an organization with a strong interest in the case's outcome. While they are not direct parties to the litigation, their contributions can be instrumental in complex cases, especially those involving public interest. The inclusion of amicus curiae in legal proceedings underscores the principles of fairness and informed decision-making. It ensures that the court's verdict is well-grounded in a multiplicity of views and is not just limited to the arguments of the immediate parties involved in the case. We hope this video has shed light on the intriguing role of amicus curiae in the judicial system. This friend of the court serves an essential purpose, enriching the legal process with diverse insights. Thank you for joining us and we look forward to helping you navigate more interesting paths in English language learning.